All right, we are back with the first game of semifinals. Team People I Hate versus Team Peepoo. So That's we're going to be playing on Bind once. It's pretty common, actually. I don't think we've seen Ascend at all yet. Yeah, we haven't seen any Ascend, which I was I already called in the beginning of the game. I mean, beginning of the mm -hmm. tournament yesterday. I said Ascend's... I, I thought Ascend would have a, you know, a better... Oh, Jumper with a nice headshot and can't see there. He's gonna get taken down for it though. But yeah, I thought Ascent was gonna be um better when I first was hyped because you know people were really hyped about a new map coming out. Yeah. But then the, re the reception wasn't that great. You could see the wall over, but it's a yeah. It's a lot this, is a, this is a very interesting uh, matchup because the defensive side haven't played at the tournament at all and they, they're lucky enough to have two buys. Yeah, people I hate had two buys, so both teams FF in round one and the quarterfinals. That's going to be the first time we're ever going to be seeing them play. People take the first round. A very clean start for them right now. That was a very good, uh, pretty much a hold after the post plan. Pretty much a post plan play right there. But the thing that I'm actually trying to see more is that they're trying to grab sight without losing so many members because they're holding a lot of crossfires. We've seen before that many teams don't hold crossfires if, or just doesn't trade in time for for it to be very effective. So I'm going to see them slowly creep around B. We only have a Cypher and Sova defending the whole entire site, but those are two visions which could easily call rotations. As you can see on the top, the map, there's a start rotating already. The Reyna and Viper leading the Sage to be flanking. Yep, Madison gonna find LH3. Blame versus sending some shock darts. Not gonna find anyone though. And we're gonna be seeing people rotating off of B. They're gonna be going for the A short push instead. Mm -hmm. As three members of people I hate are still on B, slowly gonna rotate over. Zax, they're gonna be playing through U Haul now. Only a classic pistol gonna get slow, but it's too late. Wrong direction, the team's already on site. And he gets shot through the smoke. Very unfortunate there, and very, very slow rotate coming out from people I hate. Yeah. Well, they did rotate very fast at first to B site, but that was not very effective. Yep. MVD gonna find Kansky. Some frags coming out. They're playing for this spike. The spike is, has about 20 seconds left, but they're not even gonna need it. They're gonna find the last couple of kills, and people take the first two rounds. So By that's a very clean round for Pipu since. They actually stick to their pistols that round as well, as you can see, with only one SMG buy. You can see they're now using their econ to upgrade to different ARs. Yes, this should do. Who will see better, Amir? Yeah, so coming from my second final match, um, Typically, they should be a lot closer, but because we've had mm -hmm. two FFs, uh, there might actually be a large skill gap still in this match. Mm -hmm. We're going to be seeing the slow B push this time through Hookah with two members going down B long. And yeah. people I hate actually have three members still on A site. No rotate just yet, they haven't seen anyone. Viper wall, then they go up. Gonna you know, force him to jump through it. Smoke's coming down, all three smokes blocking off both sides of sight. Plus elbow. MVD gonna find Electro Cap. Alexa Cap. Alexa Reap, sorry. Madison gonna find Flame Burst. Shot from here from Elbow. Not gonna find anyone, unfortunately. And LH3 reloading is a very, very bad spot. They're gonna get walled off the lab. They have to break the wall down. MVD can't speed. So Madison's actually gonna get flashed by uh, her own teammate, but but we're gonna see once again a f 
flawless, not flawless, but a very good sight hold. And now being up 3-0, their econ is very, is very high, and they're just continuing to stack on money. Well, on the defensive team, it's a little rough right there with just not a lot of ARs, but just having SMGs and light armor. So we're going to see the attacking starting to slowly creep up towards B site. But rotations have not been called in yet. Oh, that's a cap here. Here is him, but cannot get the peak in time. Jumper going to get first. Going to get the mm -hmm. best of him. He is down. Flame burst here trying to hold the site as best he can. Dually going to find Zaxter. That's already a 5 versus 3. MVD going to find can't speed. It's, it's a massacre. So we're going to see the TP being used for a rotation right now because most of the players left. Uh, they, they saw two on A, but they were instantly picked off. LH3 barely dodging that. He was concussed. Almost got hit. Spike is planted for A in U-Hull. And we're going to be seeing Flame Burst on the flank. Mm -hmm. I believe he did get spotted out by the Cypher Trap. Healing and that is going to be Flamers going down. Round 4 to Pipu. Yeah, I was ready to see the knife cubby from Madison. <laughs> yeah. MVD stealing his glory. Yeah, that would have made the clips for sure. But a win's a win. 4-0 elite right now for Team Pipu. People I hate are, are not putting up a shot right now as of now yep they're trying their best but they did get on my by so mm -hmm. not much we can do and this poison group actually gonna help out delay the push just a little bit see if they can get a rotate when they spot out some gotcha. players that would be a showers plus a short push Jumper at MVD going out to showers. MVD gonna find two. And that's gonna be full A side control. And I Alexa know exactly where you going are. Going into heaven, but it's too late. Cypher Cam gonna spot everyone out. They know exactly where they are. Flame Burst gonna go down. MVD gonna find him as well. That's gonna be a 4k. And 13 so and old predictions coming out in chat. Yeah, I don't. They're not really putting up a fight right now. People just wiping out the full squad. MVD carrying the team 10 and 1. This is a very nice start coming from him. Pretty much averaging two kills a round. Oh, this is a nice spot. And having a 10.0 KD. So the slows. Yep, so me pushing down a long time. So I actually see that they're really, really strong on this A side push. So I don't see why they keep going B. These A side pushes haven't worked for them. They have two members only holding down the A site. So I feel like they should be going for this. That's their overall game plan. They're a lot stronger on the site. And yep, we are actually rotating through Hookah this time. And MVD gonna find Flame Burst. Flame Burst gonna find Julian in return though. 3 versus 4. Madison gonna find LH3. Jumper gonna find Alexa Creep. And now it's all down to Zaxxer on the flank. There is a Cypher Wire there though. I'm not sure why spectators cannot see those. Mm hmm. Zaxxer gonna find blank. Jumper gonna get the best of him though. Gonna be helping out his teammate. And gonna get the kill. The so 6-0 lead predictions are probably correct. I, I'm definitely seeing a 13-0 right now. Unless the defensive side are changing up their tactics. Playing with more aggro and actually winning the, the battles. Because I'm pretty sure they're losing pretty much 90% of the aim battles right now. 
see, that's something we've seen is as we get farther and farther into the tournament, we're seeing a lot of less rushing, a lot more slow mm -hmm. and tactical plays, which yeah. I like to see. I will find this goes here. But some of these if tactical plays that aren't working, there. then you, they gotta change it oh, up. This is a nice spot. Yep. 13 0 predictions coming out mm -hmm. in our semi finals match. My prediction already is going to be Team Sim Punchers versus Team Pipu in the grand finals. <laughs> they are the current favorites to win this. So I'm not saying the ulti being played, but MVD already out getting a free kill pretty much, but traded instantly. So once again, teams are going to start regrouping and moving back. Oh, and jumper if I can see. Nice headshot there. Mm -hmm. Coming out on A. Or B. And the Cypher also is going to take up the rotate the portal. And start going through showers. Right now A, showing down Zaxxer in U-Haul. Havana, what can he do? He is smoked and slowed off. Ellie should be able to find jumper. Spike is planted, default in U-Haul, and I don't, so, know, I, I don't think the wall is up. Yeah, they're just spraying through the smoke, and that was a very lucky kill, but it still required a little bit of skill. Zax is here, gonna find Julian, right. 85 seconds, he does find Blank. Master does revive Jumper though, I know he showers, exactly. they're gonna wall off the short. Master gonna find Zaxxer in LH3, and now it's all down to one man to get the defusal. It's not enough, Alexa Cube goes down to Jumper. Wow. Madison with the BM right now. I think Madison knows that they're gonna win, and right now their plays are working out. And they're just they're just winning these aim battles and just playing a little bit smarter than the other team. Yep, and now MVD sitting on that operator. Let's see some shots. Oh, Brandon, what do you think kills. is helping Team Pipu win these rounds? Like, I think this will be their third game that they're winning 12-0. Honestly, if it, it goes to 12-0. It's just, it's just three gunfights. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so just the raw aim and their crosser placement and everything yep. is just really well placed. They peak faster, they're confident in their shots, they're landing them straight in the head. And when you get the better your opponents, when your aim is just better than theirs, <laughs> Pretty ironic, as we say that, no shots are getting landed, but <laughs> when, when these shots do land, they are it, proved yep. to be deadly. Any AR, uh, an AR to the head, that'll instant, instant dig, you're dead. Yeah. And so there's really no counterplay to that. Like, you, I mean, you, you uh, your abilities at least help you play around if you have worse aim or less skill than other people in the game. You can play around mm -hmm. some knowledge. It's better than CSGO at least. Where yeah. everyone abilities don't exist, so everyone just kind of aim is a very, very uh, a much larger portion. Off your feet! Mm -hmm. But with this one, you can still, you know, there's more team play and more use of the abilities. Because not everyone can buy a smoke, not everyone can buy a molly or a flash. Yeah. So, we're gonna see that. Exactly. They're just gonna grab sight real quick and. Just win their aim battles. Yep, jump like you get a 3k. Eight rounds in. This is looking like a 13 and oh. There's Madison. nothing more to say. They're just doing well. Yep, Madison doing very, very well here. MVD as well. Madison's currently 11 and 0. No depth yet. Can Madison <laughs> get a perfect game? Yeah. At this point. The attacking shot should just play protect the president because they're probably gonna win the game anyways. Yep, and he does have half of his ultimate up as well. Blank about to get his ultimate. Welcome as well. to my world. And Jet has her ultimate. So we're actually gonna see the Viper ulti on A just to play defense. Yep. Rotate on to B. 
they're pushing through Hookah and Long. Jet and Cypher are in Garden. Caspi is watching from Elbow. He does Damn, see that the Cypher it. does pull out some utility. And he's gonna pop the ultimate. Gonna send out the flash. Let's see what kills he can get. He does not flash anyone. He wants to prepare another flash. Flash goes out. But MVD gonna hit him. That blind did not peak MD MVD actually because they didn't go around the wall. Unfortunate placement there coming from Can't Speed. If that was just a little bit better place, probably could have got the kill. But mm -hmm. MVD with the quick reaction time does get the first. And LH3 gonna find Blank and Madison. Through. Well, MVD gonna get Zaxter as well. Turn on these boxes. Cypher and, and Silver be rotating over. And we're gonna be seeing a default plan on U Haul. Yeah. So some very lucky sprays through the smoke. But all those sprays kind of made it easier for the defending side to pretty much secure this round. MVD with a 3k that round on the operator. I was expecting two minimum. Mm -hmm. Lived up to the expectations. Let's see the ace. I want to see an ace. So, I'm not sure, but did Madison just have first death? And she I did 11 and 1. That's very unfortunate. This goes here. Very unfortunate. There goes the 11 and 0. But we're, sh we're going to see more kills coming from her at this point. TXKT is betting $100 people. I don't think anyone's going to bet against you. This game is looking over before it started. Mm hmm. So the attacking side is pretty much staying around Hookah, grabbing the Hookah control, but now they put three on site. Yep. Blank though, clean kill with the wall bank in Hookah. Mm -hmm. And is that one way I see from the jet? So smokes are getting played. They're just trying to grab site as fast as they can. Literally, I know there's one on site with them. And Jumper gonna find Alexa Queen. Kansky gonna find Blank. Massey gonna find Kansky in return. Julian on his right though. LH3 goes down. And the last man standing is Zaxter. To one versus four. He does have the resurrection. But he only has his Spectre. Mm -hmm. So running a hookah here. Many many members of people will know where he's gonna and be Interesting. At. Look, look at his money. He's at 7.4k. He's gonna max out next round. Mm -hmm. But what can they do? He can just save the KD a little bit here. Yep. And watch the rotate out. Oh, oh. and barely missing it. He should have gotten it. He should have held it. They're going to hear him be running now. He hears him running on his right and his left. Oh, but both team members are going to peek together. Oh, oh wow. but he does not die. Just in Surviving time. Surviving on the Nick. So 10-0, not a very eventful game right now since people are playing very well. Yep. 13-0 coming up. We can start seeing that the attacking side uh, the defending side is struggling with just holding sights and rotating. At first their rotates were very well timed, but now they're just over rotating or they're rotating too late. So we're going to see the use of utils. And we're only going to see one rotate from B, even though there's so much movement and noise coming from A. Yep, I would think Reyna might want to rotate as well. And now Spike is planted, rotate coming out, Cypher is rotating from the rocket. Mm -hmm. so this, one talk, this one I'm talking about on the late rotations. Yeah, they saw the commit, they saw the uh, the abilities being used, they should have at least had one with it at least. LA is going to find one, will die in return. Can't be going to get another one. He does see the brimstone as well. And Cypher now on the flank through A shorts. Dueling. Oh, Can't be going to get flank, and Dueling going to get less creep, and Madison going to find Can't be. So, the just... go next. <laughs> yeah, a good next. But the F thing is, F many teams coming on, uh, sorry, many teams from people I hate are reloading way too early, even though that, even though they have like 16 to 20 bullets in their clip. 
which is causing them to be like caught off guard reloading and a great example is last round where Madison swung right when he heard the reload. Yep. When you you only, I mean, I used to have that, that kind of habit too, where I like to reload as soon as I shoot some bullets, because considering my first the other FPS game I mainly played was R6. And the, oh, they didn't check their corners. Can't be gonna come out. Not gonna you make it. Yeah, but yeah, I I like to always um you know even just one bullet off. I was like, oh fuck, I gotta reload, right? Get out of my way. So looking at chat right now, I guess everyone is, is in the favor for Team Peepu. Yep. People's best in attorney for sure. Also true. Really. Mm. I'm expecting Sim Hunters to win. The grand finals are probably going to be Sim Hunters versus Peepu. But there's going to be definitely a fight here because those two teams have been doing very well. Yep. But looking at stats oh. right now. But looking at stats right now though, I... I think people have numbers to their favor. People best team in NA. Let's see it. 12-0. They're going to look to close it out right now. They're probably going to force buy some pistols. Madison has disconnected. Going to be a 4v5 for the first round. I don't know if this is any BM or something here, but uh, I don't know. I don't want to ruin the 12, the 13 0 record. Yep. I think all three of the last two games they played so far have been 13 0s. It'd be a shame if their semifinal game wasn't a 13 0 either. Mm -hmm. But this is a chance for people I hate to get the one victory. <laughs> so there you go. Already right, one kill. That's. Already a 5v1 situation. Oh, when can speed just chill in the corner. Thought he could survive, but he does not. Madison has reconnected. Julian trying to get some of these digs. I think he actually digs one, but they had armor. Not gonna find anyone. LA3 gonna find jumper with a wall bang headshot. And now Viper is very, very, very low. People on three members remaining. So we're gonna see this retake begin. NVD but... and Julian gonna find out two members. Julian gonna find three. That's a cup we're actually gonna get Madison. And Julian with the 4k coming in clutch. He's gonna win the game for his team. 4k in the yeah. last round. You know, he stepped up when it mattered most in the last round to get the victory. Mm -hmm. 